Yo, what's up? Hey, look. I don't know if y'all noticed, but there's been a stream of events where, like, all the fake shit is being exposed right now. All the fake hustles are being exposed right now. People are reaping the seeds they have sown. And let me get this right. It's, it's wild right now. It's wild right now, y'all. Like, you can see the enemy's kingdom is falling right now. The enemy kingdom is falling right now. And my question to y'all is, what seeds have you sown? What kind of seeds have you sown in this past season? Because it seems like the real is on the rise. And all that fake shit is, is, is crumbling right now. See, they had their fun in the sun. They had their time to shine. They had their time of getting away of doing foul shit. Of doing things that wasn't pleasant in the eyes of the most high. See, karma's a motherfucker. And I let her tell it all. No, 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 no. Let me let me let me let me let me go back on that. Let me go. Karma's a bitch. And I let her tell it all. See, in this season, in this season we're presently in, see, the real is on the rise. The real is gonna prosper. God's people is going up. The enemy's camp is slowly. I'm, ooh, ooh, ooh. Let me watch my words. 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 The enemy camp is fastly, <laughs> fastly crumbling from within. Everything that is true and of good report is prospering. All the real that that had they season of a uh, turmoil and 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 trials and tribulations, you made it through. You on the up and up. They on the up and up. They on the rise. They getting they just do because they planted seeds of a good harvest. And when the real was down, the fake kicked them. The fake laughed at them. But in this season, I tell you, I must tell you, in this season, the wicked will reap what they sown. The fake hustles will crumble. And whatever you built on a faulty foundation will crumble. It must. It will. See, God will speak a thing. And in that moment, he speaks. Spoken that thing, it is dead. But surely, if you eat from this tree, you will die. It wasn't an instant simultaneously death, but when God spoke it, it happened. But it took time for it to manifest. See, God spoke a word in past season over your life. That you will prosper. You will get what you need to get to do what you need to do to be where you need to be and to prosper how God wants you to prosper. And it's manifesting. See, it's already taking place above, but it's just manifesting now in this physical. The wicked will reap what they've sown. See, when that was spoken... It was done right then and there. But it took time for it to manifest. And the manifestation is clearly revealing itself in this season. So my question to you again, where are you on the spectrum? What seeds have you sown in this past season? See, you can do all the talking you want. You can do all the laughing you want. You can do all the joking and smoking, whatever you want to call it. You can do whatever you want. But there will be a time where you have to pay the piper. 
You have to reap what you sown. I don't care how many times you said God is good. God bless God. I don't care how many times you pray. I don't care what you do, how many times you go to church. But if you've sown bad seeds, what does it matter? Because a man reap what he sows is a law. You must reap the harvest you have sown. That's law, regardless how many times you go to church, how many times you get baptized in a month. How many times you go to the mosque, how, whatever you want to do, whatever religion you follow, it doesn't matter. Law is law. You reap what you sow. Now, I don't.